Hey guys, it's Wild. I'm back at you one more again. I hope everybody is doing blessed today. I know I'm doing blessed and highly favored, and I hope the same for you. If this is your first time coming to my channel, welcome, namaste, and love and light, and many blessings are yet to come for you. And thank you for the support and coming to see what I'm about. And if you can, please like and subscribe, even hit that notification bell so you know when I'm about to upload my next video. And if you feel like you resonate with my video, please give me a big fat thumbs up or even drop me a few lines. I love to hear the positive feedback. And I always make sure I reply to the comments that I'm being sent. And for my returning subs as always, fam, thank you for the love and support and coming to see what I'm about. And namaste and love and light and many blessings are yet to come for you. And thank you for the support and coming to see what I'm about today. Today I'm listening to um, activate your higher mind for success for your sub for subconscious for your success. I'm gonna go ahead and put that link in down in the description down below if you like to hear meditation music. Um, usually, if you if this is your first time coming to my channel, a lot of my videos I always put meditation music in the background just to make it zenful because you never know the reason why you're pulling out my videos. Maybe it's something that you needed to hear today. Or, you know, you're going through something and you're, you're questioning about the things that you're going through. So, it's just when you come in, you get um, you get insight on my videos. I always try to make sure I put positive uh, vibes and shoot positive love and light out to you. And let you be able to listen to positive uh, meditation music or jazz or whatever I felt like at that moment. But today my video is about Twin Flame 101. Do not cling to the past out of fear a lot of times we do that we fear the things we do not understand it's just like you never know what the future holds and it can be a scary thought it's just like you you know you're you're just coming out of the you know the the parents the parents nesting place and you're getting your own you know you're going out on your own and venturing it can be very scary but it can be very exciting at the same time and some of us when we have been programmed and been set into a certain way and it could be negative or it could be a redundant thing that we tend to go back when we don't understand things if, you know things that kind of scare us in a way like hold up that seems so foreign i can't deal with it because i i'm i'm, I'm a suspect suspect of that i'm not gonna say a victim but a suspect that you never want to claim yourself as being a victim because you know nobody's want to hear about you victimizing yourself so it's, it's just a lot of times we fear what we don't understand and it could be a really good thing but we if we don't give it a chance we'll tend to go backwards and we're you know like not letting go to things that don't positively serve us and it's just a problem that we have and it's just sometimes we're not even aware of we're doing it and it's just like there could be a certain bad habit we need to let go of and it's just like when you feel like oh you know you've been doing it for this long um you, you don't want to let it go it could be addiction it could be your way of thinking it could be the way you carry yourself and it's just a lot of things because it's just like with me i used to be negative all the time i used to worry about you know what friends i had and why people did this to me and why this and this and that and it was making me feel like i was a victim of something and i had to stop doing that because it's just like I really don't care what people think of me. I don't really care about what people perceive of me. It's just when I do these videos, it's just, you know, when you read the description or you see my intro videos talking about me being Prince Prince Roger Nelson's daughter and stuff like that, you know, I really don't worry about what people think. It's just like sometimes they can think, oh, you know, she's making this up or oh, she's crazy or whatever. But if you look at the videos that I've had, you know, you can see a lot of, you know, a lot of traits I might carry in my dad that people, you know, if they've been around to his concerts or they met him, a lot of people would tell me that I remind me a lot of them, you know, of him or, you know, the energy or whatever. Or sometimes people just tell me, oh, they don't believe me, but that's fine also too. And it's just, you know, I used to go in my comfort zone and just worry about what people thought of me or, you know, oh gosh, you, you know, if I let this out, you know, people are going to think I'm crazy. People are going to think this. And I had to stop doing that because I had a story I had to tell. 
And it wasn't about, you know, the big thing about just being Prince's daughter. It was about the things that I went through and the things I overcame. And, you know, to help me move on and be able to heal from certain things that even I don't even have the answers for and I still had to heal. And that takes a lot of strength to do because it's just like, you know, there's questions, a million questions up in the air why things happen the way they happen. But I just feel like in due time, they'll come to me when it's meant for me to have, you know, because it's like different things will come to me and I really didn't notice it that comes back you know from it could be years ago and it'll just be a memory that you know I didn't really think it was significant I'll come back and there'll be an answer that you know I really needed to know and it's just when we're stressing about things that takes our energy away from you know it's negative and if you need to put you know your energy in something positive that's gonna better yourself you know don't cling on to things that you know it doesn't serve you anymore it's just like everything has a purpose or a meaning to come into your life and the meaning for it to step out your life you know just like when it comes to people you you're learning things off of each other it's like you're mirroring each other on things you might need to change or things you might need to enhance and all those things but everything happens for a reason nothing is never by coincidence and nothing's never by accident You know, everything has a reason and a lesson and a blessing for it. So when you're going through things and if it's, you know, whatever habit it is or anything that's negative or anything that's past, you know, whatever is in the past, we cannot change it. No matter how painful it is, you know, there's so many things I wish I could have changed. But I know everything has its purpose on the reason why it went the way it happened. You know, nothing, you know, I was just like, oh, I wish this and I wish that. But. I wouldn't be doing the things I'm doing today if I didn't go through all those hurting pains and battle and got the scars to prove it. And I'm actually okay because I love what I do. I love making these, you know, positive videos, telling people about, you know, we're going through things. We all go through things and we all have obstacles. We're trying to, you know, you're trying to get a new job. You're trying to lose this weight. You know, you're trying to get a husband. You're trying to get a wife. You know, you're trying to make a better tomorrow. You know, we're all going through things and we all have a reason for going through things we go through. But if it doesn't positively serve you, don't put your energy into that. Not, I have to tell myself that all the time. Don't put your, your, your energy in things that are are in the past don't put your energy in things that you cannot change you know we can't change other people we can change ourselves and how we respond to things and how we go about things and it's just like you're okay you're gonna be okay you're gonna go through things and you know you're gonna be okay but you have to have that mindset that you're going to be okay so i'm not gonna hold you up I hope everybody's having a blessed night or a blessed day or a blessed afternoon whenever you see this. You know, there's a reason and a way for things to happen when it happens and there's a reason when you see this video. So I hope you have a blessed day or a blessed afternoon, blessed night. I will keep you guys in my prayers and I hope you do the same thing for me. Love and light and many blessings are yet to come and namaste to you. And please like and subscribe even give me that notification button so you know when you're about to see when I upload my next video and I will see you on my next video and hope everything is all well and good for you and peace and be wild